Hello, this is an introduction to Orchestrator Studio, a web application of Shady Edwards Enterprise One. Orchestrator is based on creating orchestration plans and schedule actions by using different components of an orchestration. You can link other servers and external systems through programming languages like Java or Groovy. And by JD Edwards database, you can create several inputs and outputs. Orchestrator is also important because it integrates multiple tasks and is functional to every business module. Orchestrator can be used in different cases, such as creating credit limit alerts, sending email messages when an item is running out of stock creating address book entries like adding telephone numbers and email addresses, creating bank reconciliation error alerts. Also, when it's integrated with AIS server, you can create equipment temperature alerts, tracking merchandise transportation, and create alerts of employees' attendance to work by using the fingerprint sensors. Just to mention a couple examples. Orchestrator is based on six components. Orchestration is the master component where the orchestration entries are defined and components added. This has a unique name and a description. Service request is a sequence of actions to evoke a particular process. This can be a JD errors process or an external one. And there are seven types of services. Form request, data request, messages, connector, custom services, watchlist, and report. Cross-reference allows relating external entry values to shady errors values. For example, a serial number can be related to an equipment number in JD errors. The whitelist allows you defining a list of values that will be authorized in the orchestration. Any value not included on this list will not be processed. And finally, the rules are logical conditions that define true or false states and the future actions of the orchestrations are based on them. The components of an orchestration work like user-defined objects. You can save and administrate them in JD Edwards Enterprise One. Orchestrator Studio includes buttons to create orchestrations for personal use, for sharing them, and also for modifying shared orchestrations created by other users. Orchestrator has several tools to analyze the orchestrations. Orchestrator Client allows you to create an orchestration preview to analyze inputs and outputs. Orchestrator Monitor allows you tracking orchestrations and control them. Import File allows you to import orchestrations in CSV format. Connections links Orchestrator to external servers and systems. And finally, a Schedule allows you to a schedule or program the frequency of an execution. Lastly, I'm going to show you a quick example of an orchestration. As you can see here, it's like a workflow and it has an orchestration, a data request, two rules and also two messages. The first step was calling JD Edwards item availability table to create the data request. Then a rule was added with a condition to read item quantities on hand that are less than 100. If this is true, it will send an email with a warning telling the user that quantities on hand are less than 100. And if it falls, it will send an email telling the user that the quantities on hand are okay. So this orchestration is very helpful to the user for knowing the item availability on hand 
and knowing if they are getting close to the reorder point. So that was a quick overview about Orchestrator. Thank you for your attention and if you have any doubts, please do not hesitate to contact us. Long